Welcome back to Soccer Gaming and welcome back to the Jackson Jensen Legacy Story. And in this episode, we are going up against rivals San Jose State. Currently 2-1 and one in the Mountain West. San Jose is coming in at 1-2. and two. So we got a big opponent, a big rival ahead of us in this week. So if you guys like to watch that, stick around. <laughs> All right, so as always, let's actually take a look at, we got a couple players of the week. I'm actually really surprised that we didn't get, yeah, I'm really surprised we didn't get, I guess we did last week, zero, last week. Yeah, I'm so surprised. I guess he had two touchdowns. Okay, fair enough. I was going to say, I had, a two, I had two guys have two interceptions and a lot of tackles. One guy had a forced fumble as well, but okay, he had two interceptions, both of them for touchdowns. It was against me. Love to see it. We did good enough to get the dub. We're happy with it. Anyway, it is a new week. It is San Jose State. So let's go take a look at San Jose State and see what they got to offer for a team and see what we're going to do to counter that. All right, San Jose State. Quarterbacks are pretty good. They're pretty quick, too. So mobile dead eye, pull down, and extender. So we're going to have a guy that's going to be hard to, um, hard to sack, but most of my sacks are coverage sacks anyway, so... I'm not sure that's really going to make a difference. We're just going to have to make sure that we spy him or have someone close that could catch him. Otherwise, he could burn us. Halfback is really fast. Wow. 94 speed, 97 uh, acceleration, 98 agility, 98 uh, change of direction. Really, really high in all of those. So we got to make sure we take care of their halfback number 23 as well. I'm hoping they have someone bad on their team. Okay, they're, they're, their wide receivers are not very good at all. Um, I doubt he sees much time, but if he does, 15's a speedster. The rest of them, um, not very fast. Tight ends, not, I, I mean, not crazy good. I mean, he's good enough, I guess. So we'll have to watch him. Left tackle's gonna be strong. Left guard strong. Uh, center strong. Right guard and right tackle. So we're gonna need to ta attack the right guard and right tackle spot. So the right side of that line will be where we come from. The left end isn't bad right ends a little worse fits a tackles not great left outside linebacker is not great Let's see what it got for man coverage 62 73 zones not good 66 83 yeah i mean they're never really great in man um uh, the linebackers so hard to get a linebacker with great man coverage but their zones are pretty low as well, too. I believe they're all under 80. So we should be able to take care of that uh, linebacking unit. We should actually have not... Well, their corners are good. They have two good corners. So free safety is not great, but they're quick. Yeah, so we should be able to take care of it. Um, we should honestly be able to run all over these guys. And that's what that's what our playing strategy is. Is basically just to run the ball down their throat until they um, until they lose, basically. So... That being said, it's rivalry week. It's time to uh, it's time to get the dub. Time to show them that Fresno State runs the states. All right. Well, I guess they're both from California, so that's why they're San Jose State and Fresno State battle it out in the rivalry. Let's get it started. We know the way to San Jose, heart of the Silicon Valley, and home to the San Jose State Spartans. And anticipation has been high all week for this one. This matchup today, part of the lifeblood of the sport. A rivalry game where the results will be remembered for a lifetime. As we'll see a squad from the Mountain West, the Fresno State Bulldogs. Taking on a squad hoping to prevent another L this week, the San Jose State Spartans. For EA Sports College Football. All right, let's jump on into it. Avocado going to return this one. On the run from Avocado going to return this one. Avocado so finds the side. Can anybody catch him? A guy from the other side. He can down to the 25-yard line. What a huge return by the Avocado, though. Holy, what a great way to start the game. The opening kickoff almost taken all the way back. Finally brought down from behind by the guy with the same number. Heisman Trophy, Amika at Megwa. In the Heisman Trophy discussion, that's kind of surprising. But it's rivalry week. You gotta make plays. All right, all right, Avocado. Oh, what a block by 67. Get out and get some, young man. 
opening drive for his offense. I can't wait to see what kind of game this guy's going to Here we go. We'll take that. Yes, I know. Keen is out there. This is his last chance. He talked it over. We're going to give the man one more chance to make things right. Greenberg says, give me the rock. They can use this first score to sort of set the tone, guys, in this rivalry matchup. Man, doesn't this feel good to come out, score early, get the crowd involved, get the nerves out of the way, Paul. All right, defense has really been our bright spot. We're hoping they can step up here and have a big performance. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Williams starting it early. <laughs> Already in the interception. What a madman. He has just been an absolute ball hawk this year. I mean, he is just making plays left and right. And the very first play of the game for uh, San Jose, going to get picked off here by Williams. I would like to see what that is on the season. I don't even know what number it is, but I know it's a lot. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful out of the backfield. Love using our running backs that way. Beautiful avocado. Get some, young man. Oh boy. So oh boy. What a good throw. Starts, but you gotta Second and very short here yeah, for the offense. He's looking to throw. Oh, what a good throw. A yeah, that was a good throw. I'll give it to him. Got it behind the line. It's cold. Oh, he laid the lockdown on him. Post trying to defend their own end zone. Oh. Third stop. It's hard to stop. Try covering a guy on one yard when he knows where he's going and you don't know where he's going. Stuff, stuff. Ha! Mine! Thank you! Golly, what a... I ran a I ran a better out than the wide receiver did. That's all that was. <laughs> oh, I cheeked him into that one. Oh my goodness, I cheeked him into it. Look at that. I came up for the blitz and then went backtracked. <laughs> I'm sorry. We gotta watch this. I'm sorry. We have to watch this. So I go in right here at 38. 38. I go in with 38 here because I want to cover if it is a screen. It's not, right? So I am dead in the water right here. Look, look where I'm at compared to everyone else, okay? And then I start going back, and I'm like, hey, look, there's a guy crossing. I should probably cover him. And just then, bloop, got him. <laughs> oh, I cheeked him into that one. That was great. That was good stuff. I enjoyed that way too much. They'll try to snap it quickly. Makes the catch. Ooh, okay. the field. It's keen. Here he goes breaking the it is. Get it. Catch it. Ooh, that was big. Let's go. Definitely not a throw you want to make, but I'm glad he made it and never got a catch it. Showing motion from the tight end, trying to get a read on the D. Oh, he had him. Well, don't let him go all the way. Oh, we had him back there, too. Dad gone. And here we go. If you're an offense, you got to get that ground game going so you could have some balance and then you give it inside and let him make some plays down the field. <clears throat> Yeah, exactly. And in coming into this game, this offense knew they were going to have to some way, somehow, at least establish a semblance of a running game for exactly what you just said. You got to be able to use Oh, get there. Oh, you were there, 35. You got to stick that big pull out there. They'll try to get it in with the run. Dang. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown. Got to be better than that. And this running back 
Got to be better than that defense. All right, offense. Keep it going. Keep putting points on the board. <clears throat> Give me all the points. I want them all. Agua maybe out of the backfield here. Oh, beautiful. Wow, two is lost. He should have had a... He should have... Maybe not intercepted it, but he should have easily made that stop. <clears throat> we'll take it, though. I'm not going to complain about that. Gets it out fast. Seventh play of the drive. It's third and one. Quickly oh, beach. Don't do anything stupid, buddy. Golly. This guy's wild. <clears throat> you never know if he's actually going to catch it or not. And then you don't know if he's going to fumble it because he's just got Play Doh hands. I don't know what he's doing. Ooh, such a big run there. God, that's huge. We'll take that. We'll take a field goal. We'll take it. Worth a try. Boom, what a beautiful kick. Well done, guys. Deficit. This could be where the game turns right here. On second down, he'll fire. Ah, he'll I just wasn't deep enough on the route. Right that gum. And he's brought down. At, he wants to throw it again. Looking for oh. the and it's caught. Dang. Wow, what a drive, though, huh? Like, what, four plays or something? Right down the field. Thanks so much, guys. And I need not tell you, rivalry games always bring out a ton of emotion. And no surprise, we saw just that in the first half today. And it's been said football is a game of inches. And guess what? Based on the comparison between third down conversion rate today and the average yard per play, how can you argue that? I mean, the low-lying fruit is to look at some of the explosive plays we've seen and panic. But really, this game is going to come down to which team is more efficient when they have the ball and how they play when it matters most. All right, defense. Last couple times, you've looked kind of meh. We're not a man defense, are we? Looks like, sure looks like it. Sure looks awfully mad at me. Oh, beat there. There we go. Oof. Well done, boys. Well done. Could be big to avocado. Or we'll just drop it off to Megwa. There it is. And the pro's good. I should have just kept running with it. I was so worried he was going to lose it. That's my fault. We'll take it, though. It's a good play. Beautiful. Beautiful. Back to be a weapon catching the ball, but that play didn't look like they were ready for him. He catches it, turns he is. There he is. Good job, Megwa. Take it in for six more points. You just simply can't say enough about this guy and what he has meant to this offense. Big time players make big plays in big games. He has shown up each and every week. That's his 15th rushing score on the season. Drive already trailing by multiple possessions. Brown wants to pass. Scrambling away. Still on his feet at the 45. And he stopped from getting the first down. Out of the shotgun on third. There it is. Jump that route. That Push him into the tent. Someone's already in there. He's going for a visit. Huge. Huge. Beautifully job done by on that jump route. Field Told him to play up. In there he did it. Right Played up. Oh, that's beautiful. That's absolutely beautiful. For a man. It's He's going for the big yeah. There we go. Beautiful catch. Way to hold on to it. Beautiful job, Cadis. On third down, going up top. Bottle little time. 
We'll take that. We'll take that. No. Oh, gosh. We'll tackle him. Into the end zone unimpeded, except for that piece of laundry on the field. This might be coming back. They'll decline that penalty. Obviously, very happy with results. And have these turnovers every single game. Can we have a game where we don't have 1,400 turnovers? I mean, our defense causes like four turnovers a game, and our our offense turns the ball over four times a game. Offense has got to be better. Job. Beautiful run, Mabel. Boy, they love to pick up this conversion and go to work with a first and goal. It'll be a run. Ooh, that's big. Way to not go down. That's huge. That was huge. From the gun, wants to pass. Get in there, Jackson. Let's go. Offenses sometimes get conservative when they got the lead and they got the ball. I love this offense. They were aggressive. They got another score added to the lead. Now you're trying to salt this game away. Try it again from the one on second and goal. Let's go. Good. Brown wants to pass. Fires into the end zone. Touchdown. Tried. Tried. I mean, it took them how long? A minute and 20 seconds to get down the field? GG's. We'll take it. You put those guys that are great catchers of the football. The first guys, what do they do? They go block. They go blow somebody up. The next guys catch the football, secure it, get your butt on the ground. And most of the time when you do this, the ball game is over. You know what's great about rivalry games? Each side hates every wretched breath the other one sucks into their greedy lungs. Figuratively speaking, of course, and when you win, oh, oh, oh is that sweet. It's glorious to, to be able to brag, to be able to text message your buddies, to be able to post stuff on social media. It's a lot of fun. I think fans like it more than anybody, but it's something that you every year you have a couple games starred. This was one of them, Jesse. They took care of business, and now you move on to the next. They really did. We saw some great individual efforts in this game by the winning team too. So came got the got the victory. Our off honestly, our offense. I felt like today was the first day where our offense actually was pretty good. I don't really know. I mean, look at that, 82% on the conversion. I mean, maybe our defense didn't do too hot. I thought our offense did great, honestly. I thought our offense did great. I thought our defense did okay. Maybe that that was the big problem. I really don't know how they like. I don't know. I thought we did fine, honestly. Dean finally had a good game. Ish. Pulled him out because he fumbled. Golly, he just turns the ball over way too much. He turns the ball over like once or twice a game. Whether it's an interception or fumble. We just can't have that. We just cannot have that. All around, three interception, we'll take it. We'll take it. Thought they did well. All right, and that'll do it for this week. We were able to win the rivalry. Uh, I believe it was called the Valley Shootout or something like that. We were able to win the Valley um, and uh, beat our rivals in San Jose State. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, feel free to hit the red subscribe button so that you don't miss out on next week's opponent. And I think we might have signed a couple of recruits, but I'll have to find that out next time. Till next time, Slacker out.